What I'm doing for my PhD is I'm studying how uh, cracks that are filled with magma move up through the Earth's crust. Uh, and these cracks are basically a way that a lot of magma can move up through the crust without having to actually move the crust very much. So it's very easy for them to apply enough force to get up to the surface. So I study how these magma filled cracks grow in the presence of a body of magma that's underground that might be under a volcano. So when these bodies are really, really pressurized, they can attract these cracks and all the magma can flow into the reservoir. Um, if these bodies of magma are really deflated, then they do the reverse. They actually push these cracks away and they can go in a different direction. So this is really important in terms of how volcanoes behave over a really long time. So if these cracks are being pulled inward in towards this body of magma, it tends to make eruptions want to happen at the summit of a volcano. It's like a typical eruption that you might think of. Um, but if it's deflated and it pushes these cracks off to the side, then it might make an eruption down on the side of a volcano, which could be like where a town is or something like that. So it's really important for understanding where an eruption will occur.